because now even in space okay this man does not give up drinking that new brain i put in his body caused him to want to drink again it might be the new teeth or something he's trying to break in but it's gone straight to his kidneys now bob needs kidneys okay it's very important for him to have fine kidneys now the problem being in space is there aren't a lot of kidneys around for him how do you find kidneys in space but luckily we had ourselves a lovely little person working in the janitor's office and they were not refilling the soap holders so i daringly asked him for a blood test and he accepted and he is the same blood type as bob so now bob is going to get his kidneys and i think that is just absolutely th generous of the man now guaranteed he wasn't exactly thrilled by the information that he was donating his kidneys to a man who has had already four sets of kidneys but when i told him it wasn't just the man having four sets of kidneys this man has in fact had four sets of kidneys all done by me then the man did the unthinkable and now if you don't know what i'm saying by saying the unthinkable he blamed me after i threatened to stab him that i may have ruined bob now yet again i don't think that is true because if i had ruined bob why would i be putting him back together so much you know and you might call it oh you're trying to make work for yourself but guess what that doesn't make any sense who would do that as a surgeon do you know how hard you have to work as a surgeon to do this kind of shit not very but you still do it anyway now i don't seem to be able to cut this particular piece uh bob you might die here <laughs> um oh wait no it's already out of you never mind there you go bob it's fine and then we just cut that bit off again yet again somebody does keep putting water balloons in you bob when i find them now there isn't a lot of people on this there isn't a lot of people in here that also weren't on the last adventure okay Oh, is that what happens, is it? I wonder what that clacked noise was. It's because we've hit something, Bob. We're experiencing... Um, what do they call it on Earth? Um, you know the word, Bob. What do they have in aircraft when they are trying to take off? Not take off. When they are trying to fl fly? Fly? Uh, Bob. Now... This could be me, Bob, but... That's one of your intestines outside in the hallway. Um, you don't need that, do you? Now, I joke around and call it a little worm, but that's definitely the small intestine. Don't get me wrong, the big intestine you don't need. That attaches to the water balloon, and the water balloon is not our friend. Okay, but... We do, in fact, need a little bit of space in here. So we will pull everything up. I need the, I need the kidneys to come up. Bat that out the way. Kidney up. Kidney to me. Kidney to me. Oh crap. Bob, guard yourself. Oh, the saw. Um, Bob, I, I need you to control your kidneys. Your new ones, preferably. There we go. Okay, Bob. Now then, these are your new kidneys. Now, with experience with your kidneys already, I can tell you that these are the best ones because these ones come from a janitor that was healthy, according to my records anyway, from what I have done to him, which was very little, I'll be honest. But, as far as kidneys are concerned, he didn't drink, he didn't smoke, so these ones you should be able to drink yourself to death in. Don't do that, obviously, because I need you, because you are physically the most paying customer I've ever had. And the least paying customer I've ever had, thinking about it, because I've done so many uh, surgeries you weren't actually part of, shall we say. 
especially in the back of our ambulance days, right, Bob? 